uh, at first glance, the Samsung Galaxy S24 series might look the same as the S23 lineup. Uh, but there are a lot of changes under the hood. For instance, the second section is the battery Galaxy S24 and Galaxy S24 Plus feature a bigger display and battery, while the Galaxy S24 Ultra is dropping its unique 10x telephoto camera optical zoom lens. The standout feature that Samsung is trying to market is Galaxy AI, which offers stuff like Live Translate, Transcript Assist, and more. However, using the new features will likely consume more battery despite the efficient Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor. You'd want these phones to charge fast and at times wirelessly to get them juiced up for the day. It may seem like a no-brainer question to ask if the Galaxy S24 series supports wireless charging, especially considering that the predecessor lineup had the feature. But there are some specifics that you need to know. First, like the Galaxy S23 series, all three phones in the Galaxy S24 lineup support wireless charging. This means no matter which Galaxy S24 you pick, the device can be refueled by placing it on a wireless charging pad. Um, and as for the specifics, nothing has changed from the 2023 flagship, so you get support for fast wireless charging 2.0, which can charge your phone at 15 watts. Um, it's not really fast uh, when considering that, uh, that OnePlus 12 charges wirelessly at 50 watts. And the Galaxy S24 series also lacks support for Qi2 charging meaning that it can't be magnetically connected to a wireless charger for better alignment. Unlike recent iPhones, you'll need to be mindful of the alignment while placing your Galaxy S24 on a wireless charging pad. And we previously wrote about how the Galaxy S23 was the small phone you've been waiting for because it was the first 6.1 inch display equipped phone that lasted full days on single charge through a week. While both Galaxy S24 and Galaxy S24 Plus are getting screen size bumps, the batteries are getting bigger too. Uh, the Galaxy S24 now sports a 4,000 milliamp battery, which is 100 milliamp hours more than the S23. On the other hand, the Galaxy S24 Plus gets a 200 milliamp hour bump, 4,900 milliamp hour battery. Meanwhile, the Galaxy S24 Ultra has the same 5,000 milliamp hour battery capacity as its predecessor. Five and $800 and $1,000 starting prices for the Galaxy S24 and S24 Plus. These devices benefit from upgrades without a price bump. But the Galaxy S24 Ultra now costs the $100 more and is priced at $1,300. It will be interesting to see how these last through the years especially now that Samsung promises seven years of security and OS upgrades.